What's up, y'all? It's your boy R to the A to the Ash. Yes, rise here with C with caution. Flint's off. And we are back 2014. That's right, 14, not 14. 14. That's why I say it. But anyway, here to talk about this whole the way. Way. Right, talk about this whole Dwayne Wayne new baby thing. We ain't gonna get into all the gossip stuff. We want to stick to most of the facts as we can. Uh, obviously, though, we know, according to him, you know what I'm saying, him and Miss Gabrielle Union was on a break in their relationship. While on that break, Mr. Dwayne Wade uh, impregnated a woman, all right, and had a baby. Did a paternity test. And the test came back, you the daddy. And so now he's another new daddy. Now, of course this has an effect on a lot of things. First of all, now, I don't know as far as their relationship, but obviously, you know, obviously, it's gonna affect him because he, he has to have a relationship with this child and with his baby mama. So that's gonna affect Gabriel Union. Not to say that he will cheat, but you never know. You know that's going to be in the back of her mind. Since she got to go see this child in L.A. Hopefully she go with him. And you got to see this woman again. So that affects, you know what I'm saying, his relationship with Gabrielle Union. And we want to look at, you know what I'm saying, lessons we can learn from this. And when I say lessons we can learn from this, this is not as in a judgment of Dwayne Wade, you know what I'm saying, he shouldn't have did this, he shouldn't have did that. We all have made decisions that have consequences that we don't think about. And I've done it. I you know, sometimes, unfortunately, continue to do it. And we want to learn from this. And I think this is a prime example. So we look at the effects, Gabriel Union. Look at the effect of his, you know what I'm saying, his other children that lives with him. Here you go, Gabriel Union. You know, she's taking care of his kids and all of these type of things. Now, they got a little brother, and I'm sure they wonder, you know, how this came about. I guess he got to explain to his kids. Um, you know how some, you know, kids are at the school he's at. Daddy's in, on TV. You know, Spain got a baby by another woman. These things affect kids, you know what I'm saying? A brother, brother by this woman. It's not their mama, not Gabrielle Union, but some other woman in LA. Fest kids. You know what I'm saying? Fest teammates. Because I'm sure sometimes there can be pressure when you have all this extra media and all this media press. You know what I'm saying? If he's stressed out, that, that not only affects him, that affects the whole team if he's not on focus the way he needs to be. Because of these new revelations. Okay? So you got that. You got the team. You got his mama. You know what I'm saying? His mama. We know his mama. She has a church and all that. But you know that's going to cause stress on her. People saying stuff about her child. You know she's going to defend her child. Mama going to defend her child. Uh, it don't matter how wrong that child is. Mama going to defend that child. You know what I'm saying? So she's going to defend her son. That causes stress on mama. All of these things are affecting other people. It's not just the way and way. I'm saying his brand. You know what I'm saying? He has this brand of writing a book about being a father and you know what I'm saying? All the benefits of fatherhood. But yet he made a decision that affects, you know what I'm saying, what some people will look at as integrity. I'm not saying I am. I'm saying some people will look at his integrity with that and having his child. And of course, we have to look at the child. He's in Miami. She's in L.A. I mean, it's great to have, you know, fatherhood. He's able to take care of his kids. And they live with him. But more than likely, <clears throat> this child is going to continue to live in L.A. He's probably not going to get, you know what I'm saying, custody of this child. So, what kind of father, you know what I'm saying, can he be with that long distance 
Um, maybe, I'm not saying, maybe we'll be able to see him on weekends and things of that sort. But he's not going to have that relationship that he has with the kids that live in the house. Fatherhood. That affects that child, the baby mother, Gabrielle Union, his teammates, his brand. All of these things <clears throat> are in effect by one decision he made to bang or sleep with or whatever uh, colloquialism you want to use with this chick. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to put the woman down either. I don't know the woman. But those are all the effects. And that's what we have to learn. That your decisions not only affect you, they affect your community. They affect, you know what I'm saying, loved ones. Not just yourself. And we have to stop being so selfish and think about how our decisions affect community fans in his case people in general role model integrity so that's my thoughts on this whole thing love to hear yours but see with Carson Block and uh you think things gonna change nah Kobe still sucks and I'm out <laughs>